Citigroup shares getting a bit of a boost today after CEO Jane Frazier announced a major reorganization. Now, the bank's latest move here is to improve profits and to streamline its business. Joining us now with more Yahoo Finance reporter David Hollerith. And David, we're at least seeing the street a little bit encouraged by what they heard today. Yeah, you know, uh, Shauna, this is a part of like something that uh, CEO Jane Frazier has sort of set out to do uh, since she took over in 2021. Um, which is really, uh, it looks like sort of a deconstruction of, of Citigroup's uh, sprawling business. It's the, the country's third largest bank. And today, uh, essentially what we heard is that this reorg uh, will take the company's two um, big major divisions, um, which houses a ton of other businesses, and basically split them into five different businesses, each of which will report to CEO Frazier. So what that does is it uh, essentially, as the bank is saying, it'll, it'll increase transparency um, and accountability for different lines of business. Um, just some context, uh, the bank has also been trying to get out of its sort of international consumer um, uh, lending bit services for the past uh, a year or so, and they're still trying to do that, and that's sort of the first step here. And then the second step is looking more at these five different parts of the business. Um, and uh, U.S. Uh, retail banking is is sort of uh, one part of the focus. Another one is markets. You know, uh, typically this actually looks more like uh, you know what the other large U.S. banks uh, appear to be. Um, but it, it's important also, too, at a uh, conference uh, later today or earlier today, but after the announcement, uh, Frazier kind of came out front and said that this is uh, the most consequential changes in terms of re in a reorganization that the company has made um, in the past 20 years. And she expects they had to make some hard decisions, and she definitely expects that not everyone's going to like it. So we're definitely waiting to see what that means. Um, and it does seem uh, like cutting some of the bureaucracy and red tape also means that there could be job cuts coming. Uh, the company uh, did not go into that or has not. Um, but from what we understand, there's going to be a town hall um, in November where more of that's more of the information is going to be sort of uh, disseminated. And so we'll be waiting to hear about that. And by the fourth quarter earnings, uh, that's when we'll actually see the changes here. And that's when we'll know sort of what has happened to City. Uh, with this reorg. So that's what we have today.